and I'll state this kind of definitively, if the brain prefers any fuel, it is ketone. Very often, informed people will say the brain prefers glucose, and I don't know of any evidence to suggest that's true. The most damning evidence against that view, against the view that glucose is the primary fuel, is in fact in, available in humans, not to mention my own data that we've published before and will continue to publish on. But we know that when humans have equal levels of ketones or glucose in their blood, let's just say they are both at five millimolar, which would be very normal for glucose, but would be considered quite high for ketones because the average person has none. But when glucose and ketones are at the same level, the brain has shifted so dramatically to using ketones that as far as the brain's concerned, it's now using about two to one ketone to glucose, if not three to one. So there's a clear preference that when given equal chance from both fuels, the brain has shifted to rely dramatically more, two or three times more on ketones than glucose. 